Have you ever been working inside PDM and you have a folder that has folder card variables on it? It's a project, so you need to update the project name or something like that. But I need to update all the drawings and all the CAD files that are in there. Here's how you do that. Inside PDM, you've got your folder card. You need to make sure that all the files that are in this subfolder also have the same project name and project number fields that you're going to update in order for this process to work. So in the card editor, I take a look at both the folder card, which has project name and project number. I look at the CAD file card, and it has project name and project number. So I know that those two are mapped correctly. Let's move ahead. Inside the folder card, all I have to do is edit values. And then hydraulic arm, let's say that the project manager wants to rename this to hydraulic arm extension. Click edit values, enter your new value, click save. But that's just changing it at the folder level. If I want to push this down into all of the files, I need to go into the files and take a look at there as well. Click on the engineering folder, which is where these files are going to be stored. Let's just do a couple of them, you know, two or three. Check these out. Click the checkout button. Let's go right back up to the top level projects folder. And then on the folder that we're going to update, let's select one folder. This process requires you to select only one folder. You can't do this on multiples unless you start at a top level and push all the values down into all the multiple folders below. All right, so select the project 1004, click modify, update, values and files. This process is really cool and it's super simple. So if we're going to update version free variables, we would also do that here. And then we do want to select update files in subfolders, click next. It's going to grab all of the states of all of the files that are in these subfolders and then click next. It just happened to find all of the files that we have checked out. So we want to select all those to be updated. And then it's going to ask us which variable we want to update. We want to select the project name. That's the only one that we're going to be updating. Select next. Add any configurations to this selection that you're going to be updating. Click next. And then you have to click finish in order to uh, run this process. It really doesn't take very long. It's just like checking out files and doing this uh, in an automated batch fashion. And it will tell you whenever it's completed. Click OK. And now if we go back into the folder, select one of the files that we checked out. Our project name has now been updated to hydraulic arm extension. That's just how you do it. Great tip. Useful for uh, updating files in subfolders of a project if you have a folder card change. Believe in the queue.